So you want to move to Elkhorn and you have a bit of money to spend. Well, in this video, I will show you what you can buy and where you can buy it. Whether you want new construction or maybe you don't want new construction, I will cover all of that and more in this video. So make sure to stay in tune. Hi, my name is Stephen Bessie. I'm a local real estate agent here in Omaha, Nebraska with Berkshire Hathaway Home Services. And if you or someone you know is looking to buy, sell, or maybe you're just curious about what the value of your home is, feel free to give me a call, shoot me a text, or send me an email at any time. All my contact information will be at the top of the description down below. Before we get started, I need to share with you the price range that we will be looking at today. We will be piggybacking off my last video about where and what you can buy if you're on a budget. So the price range that we will be looking at today will be on the low end at $400,000 to the high end at $700,000. This video will be broken up into three sections. The first section being about neighborhoods in the lower to middle area of our price range. The second section will be in the mid to high area of our price range. And last but not least, our third section will cover new construction. If all of this is out of your budget and you still wanna to move to Elkhorn, let me tell you, you still can. Make sure to go check out my last video about what you can buy in Elkhorn and where you can buy it on a budget. The link to that video will be somewhere up here or here but it will also be in the links in the description. For the low to medium end, we will be looking at this neighborhood right here. It is called The Grove. The average home price here is somewhere around $420,000. The schools that this neighborhood gives you access to are incredible. The elementary school that your kids would attend would be Spring Ridge Elementary, which according to greatschools.org and greatschools.org will be where I'm getting all my school information from just so you can keep that in mind. This elementary school is rated an 8 out of 10. The middle school is Elkhorn Ridge Middle School which is also rated an 8 out of 10. And saving the best for last, the high school that your kids would attend would be Elkhorn South High School which is the number one high school in all of Nebraska. It is also rated a 10 out of 10 for college readiness. Moving on to the medium to high end of our budget, we will be looking at a neighborhood called Riverside Hills. The average home price here is upwards of $700,000. However, you were able to find some under that price. And the reason why this neighborhood is called Riverside Hills is because it backs the Elkhorn River. The schools that your kids will go to if you lived here are also phenomenal. The elementary school is the Skyline Elementary, which is rated an 8 out of 10. The middle school is Elkhorn Valley View, which is given a score of 9 out of 10. And the high school, once again, is Elkhorn South High School, which is the number one high school in Nebraska. Next, we have the new and up and coming neighborhood, Vistancia, which is all new construction. And if you are looking for new construction, let me tell you, you will not have a hard time finding that in Elkhorn. Due to its largely growing population, there's new construction left and right. For this neighborhood, the elementary school that your kids would attend is Arbor View. This school is given a 7 out of 10. The middle school here is North Ridge Middle School, which is rated an 8 out of 10. Last but not least, the high school that your kids would attend. Being Elkhorn High School, which no, it's not the number one high school in Nebraska, but however, it is the next best thing, which is 
the second best high school in Nebraska. If this has excited you and made you want to move to Elkhorn or maybe relocate within Elkhorn, please don't hesitate to contact me today about any and all of your real estate needs. I look forward to helping you find your dream house. And once again, all my contact information will be at the top of the description down below. If you've gotten any information on this video or maybe you just enjoyed watching it, please like comment and subscribe for more about Omaha's real estate market.